we uh, determined uh, at our last council meeting that we'd have uh, a period um, between first and, and, and second reading in which we would engage in some aggressive mediation, uh, start a real conversation, a much more um, face to face, sit across the table, the realities that we all know from our, our different life experiences and professional experiences that you get across the table from somebody. Uh, it, it's amazing what you can work through and, and, and work out uh, just with, with good, strong, positive dialogue. Positive dialogue that doesn't mean that you agree on everything, but it means that you, that you, that you push and you, and you pull and, and eventually you, you come up with, with something that, that is much more representative of, of consensus and, and, and compromise. We had the opportunity um, several of us are on this table um, to meet with uh, Judge Tommy Cooper, who, other than the fact that I'm married to the most awesome circuit court judge in the whole state, uh, he's a pretty he's pretty high up there. <laughs> uh, judge Cooper, I think um, uh, uh, Charles and Michael and, and Vance, the others uh, around the table who are attorneys, uh, would 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 suggest Judge Cooper is, is highly regarded and, and for years has been oftentimes rated as the. Uh, the number one judge, circuit court judge in, in, in the state. He, he gets things done. And um, uh, we were able to, to come around the table and, and, and to build some consensus around some key points that, would, that were designed to uh, uh, allow the students at Drear tomorrow and prospectively to, to have the opportunity to experience what high school is supposed to be like there in their backyard, the opportunity to fully participate and superior extracurricular activities, athletic uh, facilities that they didn't have to drive um, far distances to. Uh, but at the very same time, um, working to, to, to meet the needs of, of, of all the neighboring um, uh, uh, communities in, in historic Heathwood and, and um, historic Meros Heights. And, and, uh, and we were so happy to have Shandon at the table with, with such a preponderance of the students coming from the greater Shandon uh, area. And we got around the table in, in, uh, that morning, early morning, 8 a.m., uh, and I think we left shy of 5 p.m. And over the course of the day, and I was in and out, we had, we had uh, the inauguration of the pre President Benedict and, and Mr. Rickenman. He said he fed everybody. So everyone was still happy when I came back. So I assume every, everyone did eat lunch. Uh, but over the course of the day, we were able to hammer out um, a, a modified plan that, that, that pulled a number of, of, of still high quality facilities closer to the commercial corridors, built some significant buffers in, restored some of the um, proposed um, housing plans to the, uh, uh, to the site, and, um, and, and represented a number of concessions from, from both uh, those representing the, the neighborhood associations and the school district and, 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 and boosters. Everyone gave something. And, and uh, I, 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 I joked with uh, Judge Cooper, because um, some of you who have had the opportunity to either know or, 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 or work in front of uh, Judge Ralph King Anderson uh, over the years, he'd always say, you know, in the, in the words of the prophet Isaiah, come let us reason together. But it's amazing when people sit down and um, um, Sam, you know, and just talk to each other uh, that um, we can get some things done together. This is not a perfect representation of exactly what's needed there. Uh, I think we determined that we're not going to let the perfect be the enemy of the good. Uh, this, is a, this is a good and strong step forward. Uh, the proposed um, plan, I'd be happy if, if some of you, I think everyone's had a chance to review this document, uh, represents a, a, a modification that, that goes back to where the school district wanted to start and where the neighborhood wanted to be in that but no one wanted to see the end of the PUD. Uh, uh, so we, we wanted to keep the PUD in place. And, and, and then the, the school district was told uh, by the city, uh, 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 I guess two years ago, that no, that was not an option, uh, that, that we indeed had to pursue a full rezoning. And that's, and that's well, when things uh, blew up. Now, since we're going to a mixed use PUD, we have, we have other options um, uh, before us. So the PUD is kept in place. And, um, and we believe this is, this is the proper way forward. This does mean, uh, as, as many of you know, that the school district's determined to, um, uh, to not pursue the rezoning of the property, uh, but to seek a, a major change to the PUD. And uh, uh, that still, there's still a process ahead. There's still a process that's, that's going to be complete, replete with, with public input and comment. And, and, and we want to make sure that the citizens know that they always have a, a, a right and a home 
upstairs at the planning commission meetings and at city council meetings and we want to hear uh, people's um, thoughts and concerns and constructive criticisms um, but again all still in the spirit of us working together because we are a community uh, and, and we're supposed to work together we are continue to work together um, I know that several of our neighborhood leaders um, put a lot on the table to, 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 to come here and, and, and to work towards a, a, a compromise and um, I want to say thank you uh, to you all. None, none of you are, are, are new to the game. <laughs> you, you, you've been um, very active in, in our neighborhood associations for, for, for years. And um, it just being mayor of the city, that ain't easy. That's not easy to do. Uh, it, takes, it takes real leaders to do that. I want to thank you for, your, for being at the table. And I know we're going to have to still dialogue a lot over the next several months as we uh, seek to make this a reality. Uh, the, the, the school. Um, Board of Commissioners. I want to say, Madam Chair, and um, uh, and uh, you, and, and, and the Vice Chair, and, and and Craig, your 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 folks were there, present and accounted for, and willing to shift and and, and change, and uh, we got magic markers out and figuring out how things move around, and and some things that that at the beginning of the day seemed to be absolutes, mm -hmm. were not absolutes by the time we got at the the end of the day. True. Um, 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 Michael representing the, 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 the families and, and, the, and the boosters and so it's so interesting obviously mo many of you who are, who are so uh, deeply steeped into this discussion as, as parents of boosters many of your children will never benefit from these improvements I mean uh, so, so, so really we're talking about a, a generation of, of, of kids and again this is not perfect uh, you know um, but we're talking about uh, about securing the, uh, the futures of a generation of children after this, not not just your kids, and I think again that speaks to the leadership uh, that we um, had um, at the table, the leadership of, of, of Drew High School, which um, I'm not going to get my butt kicked by every other high school in in, in, in the city, uh, but 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 Drew is a national leader. I mean, Drew is, is a national leader. It's put a good product in Richmond School District One. Just incredible leaders, um, global leaders, um, uh, for years, and and we I think have a collective commitment. To making sure that that continues to be the case, uh, that that continues to be the case, and and that the successes that we've seen all across Richland, like Trier, at Lower Richland, uh, uh, at, at AC Flora, and, and, and Keenan, Eau Claire, and Columbia High, I didn't miss anybody. And C. A. Johnson. Uh, and, and I, 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 I still feel obligated, as I joked last week. I also always have to reference Book of Washington because they get mad if I don't <laughs> recognize them. But the but the incredible success and and, and we 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 are, we are we are achieving things that many people never thought the district could do. I mean, from from uh, SAT scores and and Gates Millennium Scholars. I mean, we're doing some awesome things, and we're, and we're, again, we're doing it together. And we've got to stay on that path together. Um, lastly, I'll say um, um, Daryl and, and, and Beatrice, and uh, I don't think any other commissioners are, are, are here. Uh, the unanimous vote of, of a commission that I know is a lot like city council. We, we don't vote on a whole lot of things unanimously, uh, but but I know it's representative of, of some real leadership and again some give and take even on the commission. Uh, that that every, everyone's not. Um, uh, unanimous in the way in which we think or, or act, uh, and uh, and you all stepping up, and I think committing to a way forward, uh, says a, a great deal uh, about the strength of the commission and the commitment. Uh, I, I, I hope you don't mind me saying this, Cheryl. I, I'll go ahead and say it. Uh, but uh, as we wrapped up, to hear Cheryl and Mary Baskin talk about doing lunch. We, we, we got to do lunch. We, we, we committed to doing lunch. That's right. Yeah, we, 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 we got we to got, we got, we got, we got do lunch and spend some more time together. Those are, the, those are the interactions, sharing a meal. Those are the ties that bind. We have the opportunity, if we keep talking, to really get some things done way, well beyond this discussion. And, and we'll, we'll be discussing this together over the next several months, but well beyond uh, this discussion. And, and, if, and if we do that, I really believe the sky is the limit. But it's going to require real discussions. It's not going to. It's going to require us as leaders, always uh, speaking to the better angels uh, of this discussion, uh, to not allow um, uh, those who may not agree with consensus. Not not every bullet point on this. We may not agree with consensus, but who have the the luxury of anonymity and reach on the internet 
to, to, to throw out smart comments and, and, mm. and, and lob grenades at, at one another. Um, we have to ignore that. We have to ignore that and continue to dialogue mm. in, in, the, in the interest of, of, of positive resol resolution. That's what we saw last week. That's what we saw yesterday. And that's what we're going to need to see over the next two months. And so I just wanted to say, we, we, uh, to, the, to the members of the press, we, 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 we've been chatting amongst each other all day about whether we have a press conference, no press conference. Uh, I've, got to, I've got to move this around. I've got to do that. Uh, what are we going to say? And, and I just thought it was important for us just to come around the table together and say that we still got a journey ahead of us. We've we got to get through the process. Uh, we've still got a whole lot of public input uh, to have. But I remain convinced that if we, if we do it in the spirit of, of transparency and honesty and, and active, positive discussion, we can get it done, y'all.